<coughs> Little Kitty, could you please pass me that glass of water? Well, your tail isn't quite as clever as an octopus's arm when it comes to grabbing things. Why not? Ah, oh, good question. Let me answer that grabby little mystery. What makes octopuses so intelligent? Zoom in! When we think about smart animals, we usually picture dolphins, apes or maybe even dogs. But one of the most surprisingly intelligent creatures lives deep in the ocean. With a soft body, squirmy arms and no bones. Making it seem like an unlikely candidate for brain power. The octopus. Yes, octopuses can open jars, solve puzzles, escape lock tanks and even use tools like coconut shells for shelter. Clever tricks that hint at something much more complex going on beneath those rubbery exteriors. But how can an animal with no bones and such a short lifespan be so smart? Well, the answer lies in the way their brains are designed. While humans have a centralized brain and spinal cord that controls the entire body, octopuses have a very different setup. Only about 10% of their 500 million neurons are in the central brain. Around 30% are located in their two enormous optic lobes, which process vision and a whopping 60% are distributed throughout their eight arms. So, what happens is, when an octopus touches something, a wave of muscle signals travels from the tip of the arm to the base and another wave moves back from the base to the tip. Where these waves meet, the arm figures out how to respond, whether to explode the object further ignore it or even start eating it all without waiting for instructions from the central brain that's very different from a human arm which relies entirely on the brain to decide what to do but octopus intelligence isn't just about their arms scientists recently discovered something fascinating in their dna they carry what are known as jumping genes or transposons. While most genes stay fixed in one place, these jumping genes can move around, cutting and pasting themselves into new spots and sometimes affecting nearby genes. In humans, similar jumping genes are active in the hippocampus, a part of the brain involved in learning and memory. Octopuses have them too, active in the vertical lobe of the brain, which serves a similar purpose. This is a great example of convergent evolution, where very different species have evolved separately, yet developed similar traits to solve similar problems, proving that smart minds can come in very unexpected forms. Trivia time! Did you know octopuses can mimic other animals to trick predators? Some species like the mimic octopus can impersonate sea snakes or flatfish by changing their color and shape. Sketching time! Today's sketch of the day goes to Aiden Romney. Hope you learned something brilliant today. Until next time, it's me, Dr. Binox, zooming out. So, there we go, Kitty. We can't be like octopuses. Who said? The power of the octopus is mine. Great. Now you can not only reach the glass, but wash the dishes too.